guys! Since it's only a few weeks until Halloween, I thought I'd make some veggie Halloween treats for the guinea pigs. Today I made Frankenstein's monster for the piggies, and in two weeks I will show you how to make a skeleton. Frankenstein's monster is fairly easy to make, and the guinea pigs loved it. It also only consists of vegetables, and you don't need a lot of time to prepare it. But let's get started! For this recipe you will need a red bell pepper, a cucumber, a carrot, a kohlrabi and an eggplant. I started off by removing the end of the cucumber. Then I peeled off two pieces of cucumber. You will only need very little cucumber peel as this will be the nose of Frankenstein's monster. Then I cut the cucumber in half and cut off very thin and long slices. This will be the face of the monster and you'll need around three pieces. Then you'll need two slices of carrot. I removed the end and cut two slices out of the thickest part of the carrot. These slices will be part of the monster's eyes. Making the eyes look more alive is the eggplant's job. I peeled off a little bit and used a knife to cut out a round piece. Eggplants should only be fed to guinea pigs when they are ripe, which means that the eggplant has to be soft. This can make it hard to use a peeler, so be careful not to cut your fingers. Cutting the eggplant peel into a round piece isn't exactly the most fun activity in this video, but it will make the monster look really cool. You'll need two round pieces of eggplant. Next you can cut out the bottom piece of your red bell pepper, as well as another piece to make a mouth for the monster. I wanted my monster to be smiling, after all it only wanted to be laughed in the novel, but of course you can choose a different part of your bell pepper if you want your monster to look angry. Last but not least, I prepared two thin slices of cucumber to provide the monster with ears. Since it's a Halloween themed DIY, I thought why not give the monster some fangs. Also the monster wouldn't be the monster if you couldn't see a scar. You can use any vegetable that's white on the inside for this, like the eggplant you already have. We used a kohlrabi because the piggies love it. I cut the kohlrabi in half and then cut out a thin piece. For the fangs I cut out two triangles. For the scar I cut out a small long piece and three shorter pieces. The last thing I made was some hair for the monster, so I used some of the eggplant peel that was left over from making the monster's eyes and cut out triangles. Now you can start putting together the monster, just like Victor Frankenstein did. The three slices of cucumber are the face, so they go on the plate first. Then the two pieces of cucumber go under the cucumber face as his ears. Then comes the eggplant hair, the carrot eyes and the eggplant eyes. Next, I gave the monster his bell pepper mouth and his kohlrabi fangs as well as his scar. Since he looked kinda empty without a nose in the middle, I used some of the leftover cucumber pieces to give him one. Now you've created your very own monster. Let's ask the guinea pigs for their opinion. 